Intel i7 14700K app, 32GB of DDR5 RAM and RTX 5060, 8GB. And this is FPS when we are at 1080p completely maxed out graphic settings and we're using DLAA, so no DLSS. What I have noticed that you cannot use so hype by Nvidia frame generation on RTX 5060. As you can see 1080p resolution, DLSS is DLA and we're going to use frame generation 4x. And as you can see 80 FPS and we're back to 49, 50 FPS as before. We are completely out of VRAM. Without VRAM you cannot have frame generation at all. It doesn't matter what you will do. You can look down, you won't have 4x, look. 63 a little bit more yeah but this is not 4x i'm just blown away nvidia was pushing this card for 1080p gaming and was advising to use 4x frame gen but how you can use 4x frame gen if you are out of vram no it's not going to work you can see it by yourself and to make things worse you can see that we're sharing right now 1.1 gigabyte ram to vram that's quite a lot Still 1080p resolution, DLSS is DLA, completely maxed out graphic settings, but let's go for 2x frame gen, maybe this will work. We're at 96, okay, 54, 55, <laughs> nothing. We don't have frame gen. What is the point of this card? Oh, it went 74 and back to... I think frame gen kicks in a little bit when you look up or down. Okay, let's keep 1080p, DLSS, DLA, 2x frame gen, but let's lower our settings to medium. Maybe this will help. And we have, yes, frame gen 2x is working with 100 FPS, 96, because we emptied a little bit of VRAM, just slightly, so we could use 2x frame gen. But you have to set this game at 1080p medium settings. Are you serious? Medium settings. Still 1080p resolution, DLSS is DLAA, medium settings, but this time 4x frame gen. Will this work? And with 95, 65, and uh, yeah, we don't have enough VRAM anymore. I think 4x frame gen just eats a little bit too much of VRAM, and yeah, you don't have 4x in this game at all. This is 1080p medium. Think about it. Let's stay at 1080p, DLSS is DLA, 3x frame gen, medium settings. And 3x frame gen is not working as well. Still not enough of VRAM. You can use only 2x. So what's the point of this card? Just buy 4060, save some money, still 8GB card, you have 2x frame gen, as you can see, 2x frame gen, let's see, and uh, it's hard to tell, <laughs> I think it's not working anymore. <laughs> Let's keep 1080p resolution, DLSS is DLA, completely switch off frame gen, medium settings. Let's save the settings and what FPS we'll have? 68, 62. Basically, this is no frame gen FPS. This is just sad in my opinion. Why would you even consider this card if you cannot even use frame gen in this title? And we'll have more titles like this in future. Check this out. 53 FPS at medium settings. DLA. 1080p and the worst part about it that Nvidia is pushing frame gen on this card but where is it? I reinstalled the drivers, restarted the PC and frame gen still is not working. Nvidia just forgot to mention that these games will be super VRAM hungry and frame gen what needs? VRAM. You don't have VRAM? You cannot use frame gen at all. But what is the point of this card if you don't have frame gen at all? Buy RTX 38, you'll have a little bit more of VRAM, 10 gigs, and that card costs right now somewhere around $300. And the best part, RTX 3080 is 50% faster than RTX 5060, and will also support DLSS 4. So you will be able to play your favorite games at 1440p or 4K by using DLSS of course, but DLSS 4 is good DLSS, and you'll have somewhere around 60 FPS. And RTX 5060 should not be purchased. So what do you think about this? Leave comments down below. Hit like, subscribe and I will see you in next one. Bye.